From Studio 3 at Buzz TV, it's The Horse's Mouth with Tom McManus. All right, time once again for another edition of The Horse's Mouth here on Buzz TV at Tommy Max back at the bar. Brought to you by our friends at Goodfellas Cigar Lounge and Spirits, as well as the wealth advisory team of Bruss Nutter in Ponte Vedra Beach. We're, we're talking sharks this time around. The Jacksonville Sharks are here for the first time on the horse's mouth. Let's welcome in Saya Burley. He's the head coach. Devin Wilson and Nyquan Murray, two players of our 7-5 and five Jacksonville Sharks. Coach, great to have you. Great to be here. How you doing, man? Wonderful. I mean, we've won a few games straight now. Yeah. Uh, we're rolling. We're getting back healthy. So yep. that's exciting. So we have uh, two games left to uh, make this playoff run uh, start. So you're 7-5. and five. Yes. You're, the sights are right there. You just got to win the next. Do you have to win the next two to get in, or what? How well, that'll, that work? that'll determine seating. So okay. we have a chance to get as high as one, okay. uh, or even two seed, uh, depending on who wins and who loses the next okay. two. So games. four out of the six make it. Is correct. that correct? Yes. Wow, man, that's exciting. You, you're a double champion, national champion. Yeah, yeah. We, is that we, how won. They, they say it. Yeah, we won yeah. twice, so we're chasing a third. Dude, how hard is that? That's got to be hard. Every year is, is even more difficult. You know. I, I didn't mean to cut you off. How do you, how do you? Because Doug Peterson with the the Jags now, right? I'm always enamored that he won the Super Bowl and then they went to the playoffs back to back, which is really hard to do, right? Sure. How do you keep the, How do you keep your team together, focused on winning and not all the individual stuff that comes with winning? It's very difficult. Uh, you bet. I think the leadership, like Devin, uh, is very important. Uh, yep. I don't play the game, I coach, but you got to have leaders in the locker room that on the other side of that fence between coaches, players, you know, can drive players and continue to. Make sure you lead by example on and off the field and keep guys motivated. Um, so that's where it starts is with the character in the locker room, leaders like that. And then yep. just making sure uh, you never let guys relax, you know, stay competitive on every aspect of the game and practice and on the field, off the field and, and keep guys come in throughout the year to keep yep. it competitive and being ready for the depth of the season because, you know, 15, 16 games, somebody's going to get hurt. And that's yeah, what we ran into totally. this year. Uh, yep. So we've stayed competitive throughout the season, adding additions, uh, you know, mid-season to late that really sprung borders through the injuries and on to this position right here. Awesome. Well, we'll get back to you. Devin, good to have you, man. How are you? Good. How long have you been playing Arena Paul, man? Uh, this will be my seventh year. Seventh year. Yeah. Great. Whitney, you went to Tennessee State, you said? Yes, sir. You're a wide receiver? Yes, sir. You like that that bomb down the field or yeah. what's up? Yeah, that makes it yeah. easy. That way you yeah. don't, have to, don't have to run so far. What's yeah. his best attribute as a, as a receiver? The, the bomb, the 50-50 ball. Just throw it up. <laughs> just throw it up and go yep. get it, right? Yep. Jump, there. go get it. It's my ball. I'm mm -hmm. down there somewhere. Is it like rebounding almost? Like in basketball? Like definitely. this is mine, I'm taking it? Definitely, right? definitely. Yep. So like in uh, high school and stuff, that's kind of when I went to college, that was one of the things my uh, receiver coach really liked about me was okay. I had that attribute and stuff from playing basketball. So, so tell me, I've never done it. What's it like winning a championship? What's it, I mean, and you've won two now yeah, with the Sharks. It, right? What's it's, it like? It's hard, kind of like what Coach was saying. You yeah. know, it's a lot of um, – takes a lot of time. takes a lot – you got to have some luck. You know, you sure. got to have a lot of things working in your favor. Yep. Um, but it starts, you know, from the top, you know, with the coaches. Um, then it trickles down to us and stuff like that. So – uh, it's fun, you know. Yep. Uh, it's, it's definitely something we're trying to do again and repeat again to, you know, get this guy one. Yeah, absolutely. Nyquan, how are you, man? Thanks for having Great me. Great to have you on. You're you're a newbie, right? Yes, sir. First year, first from year. Florida State. From Florida State. So tell me, what's the arena game? How's it? How's it? The, what's the most difference coming from Florida State playing um, in arena ball? It's very different. It's very quick. Yep. You know, uh, the game is very fast. Route running is different. So coming coming from outside football and coming into arena. Yep. You got to switch up the way you run routes and, you know, just adjust to the game. And I yep. think I adjusted good with these guys here, Coach Burley and Devin. Yep. Me along the way What's your there. favorite route? Uh, Besides the bomb, everyone wants the bomb. Go deep. <laughs> okay, I'll go deep. <laughs> I, I really don't have a favorite route. Just nope. give me any route. Do you have time? <laughs> nice. That's the attitude, Coach. The young, the, young the, the young lion, right? Yeah, just yeah. give me all. I'll take them all. <laughs> exactly. I'll take, how about setting up uh, the, the defender? Do you have time in the, in the arena? Um, like in the arena game, do. do you have time? I mean, because it's so quick, so okay. it's either there, there or not. Boom. boom. Yeah, it's right? a quick move. Kind of like crossover. Yeah, quick like crossover. Move, right? You got to make sure, right? Uh, how about the hits? hits? I mean, you got to – I mean, you come inside. I mean, it's it's not a wide field, right? How wide is the field? It's 20 yards. Oh, my gosh. It's like a phone booth, right? Yeah. I mean, yeah, comparatively yeah. speaking, you know, it's okay. like cause they're coming, right? But I'm more worried about the wall. <laughs> the wall. Yeah. So the wall, I asked you before, like I always thought the wall was like this flimsy, no. padded, no big deal, but it's the hockey wall yeah. with some pads on it. Serious wall. Whoa, yeah. hip pointer. Yeah. Did you get one? 
Not yet. What, 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 <laughs> do you have a story to that I'm missing? Did you get knocked into the side of it and didn't get I mean, up or what? First game of the year, I had um, a kick return. And yep. I ran towards the wall. I almost got knocked over the wall. So <laughs> from then, I told myself, yeah, no more about the wall. You can't use the wall. The wall is not your uh, advantage, yeah. right? Not All right, who do we got next? You got a game coming up this weekend? Yes. Who do we have? We play um, San Antonio. Okay. Gunslingers. What are they going to bring to the table that you're going to have to I handle? I mean, it's a pretty good team, you know, even yep. though their record is like 3-7. and seven, uh, Can't take them for granted, right. you know. Yep. Last time we played them, we scored on the last play of the game to beat them. So cool. uh, it's a pretty good team. Got to go in here, you know, with our head straight. Yep. So you're win. keeping the dream alive. And you get to play a game you love, right? I'm That's too old. <laughs> Not that I would. Not that you you're insinuating, you know. yeah, right. but no, it eventually <laughs> you can't. Eventually you cannot. People yeah. ask me all the time, do you miss it? Of course I miss it. I miss it every day. I'd, sure. play, I'd still play today, but eventually you just can't play, right? You, the time catches up and whatnot, but you guys are still doing it. That must feel pretty good. Well, you're you're young. You got yeah. you got like 30 more years to go. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah. I can run for days. Can't they, coach? Can't right? Can't it's they, easy. Devin? That's true. But seriously, that's a, a great thing. Tell me about the, the, the fans here in Jacksonville. Talk about, talk about your home crowd. Oh wow! Yeah, um, I mean, pretty this awesome. is my first year, yeah. first year arena, so they pretty good impression on me. Yeah. Did Every you meet day. Emmanuel Falloran? He's your MC. Oh yeah. 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 So ET. Mm -hmm. So I do radio with him. He's, oh, yeah, he's yeah, our yeah, producer. Yeah. yeah, he's great. Yeah. But it's a great atmosphere, right? It makes you, Absolutely. you know, you got yeah. the music, you fire it up, you get to basically go into a fist fight and <laughs> fight with your teammates and hopefully come out on top, right? Definitely. Yeah. How about injuries, coach? Are there a lot of injury? More injuries? Same? It doesn't really matter. You know, being a it's quick football. Game. Yep. Um, you know, they play on a hard surface. Yeah. So, yeah. you know, I don't know if it, that's attributed to that, but, you know, you get some knees, get a lot of ankles, get turf toes yep. for sure. Yep. On turf every day. Uh, Steel like shanks. Outside. Right, you got to put them in the shoes. Right. We don't yeah, like those things. I don't even know if they work. But, yeah. You think those things work? You know when they put them in the shoe, you know how uh, so you don't bend. Yeah, that's what you bend your big. Toe. Helped me a little bit back in the day when I had to turn. Did it? Yeah. A little bit, not much, but yeah, linebackers bit. don't run on their toes, or at least right. I didn't. Right. <laughs> I wasn't right. athletic enough to do that, I guess. Right. Now you seem pretty even keel, man. You, you yeah. gotta. I'm sure you get. Does he get fired up in front of you guys? Oh yeah. You, if you piss him off, does he like get oh, really yeah. ticked yeah. off? Oh, he's gonna let yeah. you have it. Yeah, he I gonna love let that. You have it. Well, you gotta have the fire, right? Yeah, but arenas is so you. up and down. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like you, you can be up twenty and then all of a sudden a tight game, or you can be down twenty and get back in the game. So right. I try to stay even keel. I can't always do it, but right. I try to stay because you know the motions of the game are highs and lows with arena football. The field's so short, you can score on one play. Yeah. So you know you gotta just stay with it. You know, no matter what happens. Yep. The time can you changes. Yell at the ref? Can they find it like they do in the NFL? It depends can you on what you say. Really? Yeah, yeah. they can throw a flag on you. Yeah, they can for sure. Absolutely. Wait, yeah. that, then you got to keep the even keel. Right. Right. You can't cost your team a penalty. Coach. Exactly. Right. Exactly. So. <laughs> All right. All right. So what? What are we thinking, fellas? Playoffs right around the corner. Right? You got to get a great seed. Oh yeah. yeah. Got to exactly. win the whole damn thing. Got to get a home right? game. Why not? That's the plan. If it's not you, who? Right. Right. Exactly. That's yeah. fantastic. Well, thanks for being here. I really appreciate. It. Excuse me. I love football. Of course, it's been a big part of my life, most of my life, and I say, look. Any level of football, keep playing. Right. Sure. Keep the, keep the dream alive, man. Definitely. Great to have you. Coach, Appreciate all the best. You. Best Absolutely. of luck the rest of the way, all right? Thank you. Bring home a championship, Devin. Thank you. All right, Nyquan, yes, nice sir. to meet you guys and all the best. We're talking football here, baby. Finally. My gosh, we've been talking IT and all this other stuff. Half the time, I don't even know what they're talking about. But <laughs> I do understand the game of football for sure. So until next time, stay safe and be cool out there, man. And we'll see you right here on the horse's mouth. Cheers.